Hey, how's it going? Welcome to Crystal Isles. We are playing with the Fear Evolved um, mods on this map. Never mess with them, but I know it changes the way that everything works with dino taming and things like that and spawns. So it should be, should be interesting. I can see a lot of deaths coming here pretty soon. <laughs> but we have played Crystal Isles before. It's a very large, fantastic map. I think the first thing we need to do is get some pants. Getting pants is always an issue. And we'll probably need to get a bed set up fairly soon as well, just in case we die. I'm not sure how the creatures work. So I know there's a bunch of different tiers for the different types. So that's going to be it's going to be kind of interesting to figure all that out. And we have a ton of new Ingrams as well. So let's see. Yeah, so see there's a spear. That we're supposed to be able to use for taming. There's also a workbench we need to get set out. Here's one of the new things here too. That's a healing stew. Okay. 5% of your creature's health. I mean there is a ton of stuff. So let's get kind of set up. Oh yeah. Here's the, the smithy that we need to build. That one's supposed to have everything in it for the new thing. Hey. How's it going man? Just woke up just in time. Yeah. Just starting out. So let's see. Let's get some clothes. And then we'll try to find a place. I'm not exactly sure where we want to set up at. Preferably near the water. We do have that canoe, so we can use it for getting around. Let's see, we need to get stuff made up for a pick. We need to get a bow and arrow going. And that looks like one of the new trikes. Okay, okay. 3.45 a.m.? Oh, man. Kind of early there, huh? It is 6.45 p.m. where I'm at. Always have problems finding that first stone, man. There we go. So we are playing with our, our character that we always take in between the maps. So we're not starting off fresh. We just don't have anything like usual. We'll get our normal tools going. And I'm not sure if... Making a pike will help? Dude, I don't know if they're aggressive. That's a thing. So trikes normally aren't aggressive. What are we missing for that, Flint? Don't sleep much or I miss most of your streams? Oh, man, yeah. <laughs> I know how the sleep thing goes. Have that issue myself. All right, we'll get this going. Nice, nice. Let's try to get us a bow. Do we have enough stuff yet for it? We don't. Missing probably. Oh, oh we're missing fiber. Uh, dude, don't kill me, man. Hopefully he's not aggressive. So that's not a trike. That's not a trike at all. Nope, that is not a trike. Oh, dude, we are about to die. Parasaur, man, help me out, dude. Okay, so those things... <laughs> I didn't know it adds new dinos. I thought it just had variants of the normal ones. Sorry, we'll get out here in the water, man. Hopefully the new can't swim. I do not want to die two minutes in to the new mod. Interesting. So, yeah, it's going to be kind of neat seeing what creatures are new. I'll have to uh, <laughs> get a spyglass made as soon as we can. Luckily, there's crystal all over. There's actually some right down there. We're going to need some hide, though. I'm not sure if there's new water creatures as well. Oh, that's not crystal. Those are plants. I thought that was crystal under the water there. I know there's some right over there, the blue. Maybe we'll start making our way that way as we're collecting some stuff. We need to get some flint, make some arrows. That way we can kill... If there's any dodos around, try to get some hide and then bolas like usual. That way we can at least run. Go punch a leads. Yeah. Yeah, I've done that before. Dude, ate me, man. That's, uh, that was one of my goals back when I first started playing Ark, to, to run up and punch one of everything. I don't know, it was just, <laughs> just something I always wanted to do. Alright, so we got the bow. We don't got the bow. Pick up our whole nine arrows. Dude, where's a dodo when you need one, man? It's nice being out here on the beach, though. That's the one thing I like about this map. 
Oh, dude, that is way out in the water. You're really going to need a spyglass soon, though. So might as well just go ahead, take a dip down in, grab them. As long as the mana doesn't come for us, we should be all right. Punch a titan. Oh, man, I don't know if there's titans on this. So I looked at getting the other mod for this map that adds in a whole bunch of the other creatures. And see, that mod originally just gave, like, the basilisks. They gave in the, um... The other flavors of the wyverns, it had the rock drakes, but now, man, it's got so much stuff. I didn't, uh, I didn't like it, so I took it back off before we started the stream. So it kind of sucks, but I mean, it is what it is, so I don't think there's going to be any rock drakes on this map. Alright, let's get a little bit of crystal. That was a long run for a tiny bit of crystal. How much do we need for a spyglass? Oh, we got enough. We just need to get some hide. Okay, cool. That's kind of on the menu for the day anyways, is getting some dodos or something killed. Extra dino mod? Yeah, that's the one I was looking at. But, dude, they got so much weird stuff in there, and it was messing up all the spawning for the Primal Fear creatures. That's the main thing I wanted was Primal Fear, so I kind of... Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I'm not exactly sure how different things stack with each other. I know a lot of them will affect the way that other ones play out. Dude, I cannot find a dodo to save my life. What level are you? Nah, I can't kill you before you take off. Oh, there's one. Did I not put my bow down here? Well, uh... I guess I shouldn't run towards dodos. What is a nuka dodo? <laughs> oh, man. Ark, as we know it, is totally different now. I don't know. <laughs> oh, man, there's going to be a lot of deaths in this series. I can see it already. Well, we're by the crystal again, at least. Oh, dude. So, dodos? <laughs> dodos are not safe. I uh, just made my pants. Just got my bow. All right, so... Maybe we should, uh... Oh, man, I don't know. Stay away from the dodos. Hey, how's it going, lady? We are playing on Crystal Isles now with the Primal Fear mod. And, oh my gosh. Is it not, not, not safe? It's not safe. Is that like a normal Dillo, or is that another nuke one, or whatever it was called? Oh, dude. I just need, I just need their stone. One stone, please. Try to get my tools again. Yeah, that dodo was no joke, man. I should have known something when he was running towards me. With his wings out like that, you know? So I have to look it up. Like I said, I need to see what the different tiers are for the creatures and stuff. There's a stone there. Nice, nice. Okay, let's get our stuff back again. Oh, they explode when you get close to them? Ah, okay. Well, that explained why I died so quick. Dude, that was, uh... Oh, man, that thing was no joke. Alright, let's get some regular stone. See, that's why I need to get that spyglass going, so I can actually see what is what. Let's get some pants. Get a shirt and a hat. Might as well eat some berries. We have a ton of them. Alright, so... Back to square one. Let's get some stuff for another bow and arrow. I guess I'll have to, uh... Definitely keep stuff at range for right now, right? Alright, so that gives us a little bit. So I wonder, is there, is the, is the dodos the only thing that explode on you? Or do I have to worry about like pterodons and stuff like that as well? Please be a normal one. Please be a normal one. Yep, that was normal. Cool. Oh, there's some hide. 
First thing is bolas. The whole one. It's alright, that one will keep us alive. Ah, uh, dude, I do not want to think about what the raptors are going to be like. Alright, let's get a sleeping bag out. Cheap to make. What are we missing? Stone and thatch, okay. Get a little bit of thatch. So I guess we should start making a little base. Let's see, where are we at? Oh, we're way down here. I thought we were back up towards the middle. That's fine, though. That's fine. It's just our starting base. Let's go over here. There's plenty of trees. We'll do it right on the edge over here. That way, like I said, we have access to the water and everything. Build a canoe. Be able to explore a little bit better. Start grabbing some fiber on the way. We'll have to see. I might have to up the dino count a little bit, too. I kind of wanted to see how it goes. I don't want to have the whole map overpopulated like usual. Are we good? I think we're all right over here on this one. Dude, that other island was horrible. Well, I mean, just that one dodo made it horrible, right? That's not a normal Bronzo, is it? Oh, we need to make a... Let's make a spyglass real quick. We got all the... We got the hide and stuff, right? Yeah, we got enough hide. That is definitely not a Bronto. Are y'all normal? You're not changed, are you? Nope, you're not. Some easy hide, though. That's a level 145. Poor dude. My arrow's back, man. Things are expensive when you're starting off. Yep, you're next. You knew it was coming. Alright, let's get a little bit of crystal. Not from that one. Tell you what, man, everything's kind of worrying me. I don't know if the pterodons are normal, too. All right, one spyglass. Can we make any more arrows? We can. A whole four. Alpha Brachiosaurus. Oh, dude. So alphas, you're supposed to be able to tame in this, right? I mean, of course, I mean, not not right now. Is that like a normal alpha, though? Does it come for you kind of like the alpha cornos and stuff? I don't know, man. Maybe it's a, maybe it's a bad idea to be building over here. <laughs> Dude, colors on that one, too, is crazy. High level, fabled. So there's what? Fabled, apex, toxic, and I think something else, right? For the different kind of tiers of everything. Hey, Croc, there's your leads, man. It's a regular one. He's a little bit beached, but that's fine. All right, let's start getting our stuff for a base. Do a little two-by-two two like usual. Probably... I was going to do thatch, but... Well, I mean, I guess wood doesn't matter either right now, right? Could be thatch, could be wood. Something's going to take us out. It's going to take us out. We are definitely going to have to get turrets put up, though, on this map. I usually don't build them because single player. But, uh, <laughs> with everything being not safe, we should definitely get some. I think right down here will be fine. All right, let's do... Just do some wood ones. We'll get these three set out. Go grab some more resources. I want to get our bed put down as soon as possible. So, uh, start it right here. 
right here. Yeah, it's a nice looking map. Alright, so we're good for one respawn. We'll prioritize getting this out, or getting the walls up and stuff, and then... Well, that's invisible. And then trying to get smithy and all that stuff going, too. And check out the smithy. We need to get a regular or a regular one, and that one is for the mod. Try to see what all it has in it. Get somewhere safe. We'll take a look at all these new Ingrams and everything that came with the mod pack. Alright, so that should be enough for our other foundation. Do a double doorway. And double doors. We can always expand this later if we want to. Nice, let's drop. A lot of these berries and stuff that we don't need right now. Eat a bunch of them too. Luckily there's water nearby so we don't have to worry about that. And then food will get sorted out later. Got enough berries right now. We got to get so much fiber. We'll have a ton of berries. And we need to figure out about taming something here soon after we get the walls up too. Kind of like a little pack mule. And drop the salt. We don't need that. Alright, cool. Starting out on a new map, man. It's always like the best part and the most stressful. I mean, that is until you get your walls up and stuff. Then you're kind of good. And a regular bed so you can respawn. Let's make these as we're going. Two, four, six, we need enough for one more. Alright, get a little bit more fiber. And we probably gonna do just like a thatch on the roof. Nice, nice. Have to get a little storage set up out here too. You should see what's in the water here. I don't know if it's deep. Oh, deep enough right there. All right. Let's get one more of those. Hey, Broken Skull, how's it going, man? We've uh, we've already died to a nuke dodo. Didn't know those were a thing, but apparently they are. Let's see, we need two of these and another one of those. Which country views you more? Um, it, it varies. It varies a lot. It changes in between. Um, sometimes it's the USA, and then sometimes it's like. I get a lot from Brazil, and then sometimes it's India, and then sometimes it's um, Canada and Australia. So it varies. It's really weird how it varies so much from month to month. That's why it's kind of hard for me to pick a stream time. I was trying to do some in my early morning and some in the evening, but it's like... Yeah, it's it's so so different. It's kind of hard to get it where it's enough time for everybody to watch. All right, so which one was we needing the right or the left? I think it was one of these. And one storage. What are we missing for that one? Probably wood. And then we need to look at... I think we need to forge. See, those invisible trees are kind of getting me. 
the forge and stuff so we can get that smithy going. I think we need like five metal. Is it the same for the new smithy? Oh, that one needs a crystal. Interesting. Everything else is the same. So I wonder if we can do... Is this everything from the Primal Fear mod, but is it, is it like a normal smithy too? I don't know. We should probably build... Well, that one first. Just to see. You thought India would be there? Uh, they are. Sometimes it is. It, uh, like I said, it definitely changes. Alright, so. That out. And this is totally not gonna be safe from anything. Not even a dodo now. <laughs> Apparently, right? Wait, wait, what are you doing? There we go. Cool. Storage box. Did we not make one? All right, let's store all this extra junk and see where we're at in life. So we're going to need some more crystal. That's fairly easy to get. It's just right outside the door. We'll save those, and we'll save those. Because I think a lot of the berries and stuff we need for crafting, there's some new recipes and stuff like that for, for foods. Dude, I'll tell you what, I need to turn... Auto close only. There we go. I'd like to open it myself, please. So grab some stuff for a couple more arrows, and then we need to get some more hide and stuff going. So I wonder if you can actually tame those to ride them now. I know it said a lot of stuff is rideable and tameable that's usually not. That would be something to have that's pretty cool in the water. I mean, it's huge too, right? Is that a regular wyvern or? What? Yeah, hey, what's up, buddy? Should tame you. Luckily, those are passive tames. Good to have, first off, too. We'll, we'll worry about that in a little bit here. Try to find us a couple more of those little dillos or the lystros around. Hey, Dinosaur, how's it going, man? Just starting out on Crystal Isles with the Primal Fear mod. It's been interesting. Let's just put it like that. <laughs> we died already. Was an exploding dodo. Apparently that's a thing. Alpha Rex and Gigas are no longer the uh, alpha creatures. Let's grab some of this metal too. We're going to be needing some of it to smelt stuff up. If you fight them, yeah. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. I mean, there's some new creatures, too. Brachiosauruses, those are uh, those are new. There's a new kind of thing. I thought it was a trike. It, it wasn't a trike. Repair this stuff while we're waiting. What are we missing on that? Oh, Flint. I do like the wyverns on this map, though. The different bonuses that they have. It's kind of kind of different, you know? Let's repair you two. So that should be enough metal. So really wanting to get a little bit more on the hide so we can have enough because we're kind of out already. Might need to up the dino count a little bit. It seems like everything's kind of spread out. I know that was a problem when this map came out, like the original map, was not having that many creature spawns. Oh, dude, really? My last one? My only one? He turned. Are you normal? You're normal. Yep. I'm not going to hit you, though. Oh, dude. Get punted out into the water. Yep, yep, yep. No dodos or nothing out here. Boy, I tell you what. So are those things aggressive? I'm guessing no. I don't want to get too close to find out. I'll tell you that.
What are we missing for the smithy? Should be just a metal, right? Or not the smithy, the forge. Yeah, just a hide. Okay. I think we've only got 10 back in base. Might have to make a... A canoe and go to another island. Or just run over there. Might have to do that too. Can a guy get some dinos, man? Holy crap, dude. Alright, well, let's go for a swim. We'll head over that way. And then we can always loop back around, because base is just right over there, too, I think. And there's a... Is that a shark? I don't know. It's too shallow to see. Oh, dude, it is. Wait, that is different colors on him, too. I don't think he can get up here. Toxic Meg. What? Interesting. Hey, Jurassic, how's it going, man? We are just getting started on Crystal Isles. We're trying to get our normal equipment set up. We died to a exploding dodo. So that's a thing. Just need to get some hide and stuff so we can get a forge going. Then we can get our smithy. But, dude, it's like the, the spawns are kind of sparse over here. We're at a stamina. Yeah, we're going a long way around. I could almost kill that leads off. I don't have a, enough arrows or anything. Be a lot of hide and prime meat. Oh, never mind. Sharks got him. Yeah, it's a bad, <laughs> a bad place for you to spawn, man. Ah, oh, dude, look at him. Just big enough for him to spawn in there, and he can't get out. All right, buddy, get your stamina back, man. We got a lot of running to do here. Exploding? Yeah, it was called a nuke dodo. And apparently when they get close to you, they explode. Ah, it killed us instantly. See if we can't find some over here, get some hide from. I don't know, man. It's kind of hard to find stuff for hide right now. I'm sure there'll be plenty later. You know, you always end up trashing it before too long. Ah, oh, the seagulls. Totally forgot about those. Try to avoid them. We don't have much. I don't want him stealing it. Ah, there we go. Finally. Totally missed. We'll kill him and the other one. Make some more bolas. Kill the parasaur. That's what I should have done in the first place. We should be good on hide. Make five. That way we got plenty of them. Seems how somebody always misses anyways. Hey, buddy. Need to tame one as a pack mule here soon, too. Or tame something as a pack mule. Cool, so we can make our forge. Grab, grab a little bit more fiber. Nice. Well, let's start heading back. I mean, there's a lot over here for hide, but I think we're kind of set. We have we've got 72 more. 45. 
65 so we should be good make both of those if we need to make both we'll make the new one first of course and see what's in it hopefully there'll be everything in that one so we don't have to make two Over the thatch on the way back well at least there's nothing aggressive over here other than that one dodo so far and then that thing that I thought was a trike. But that's kind of on the other island. We're kind of, we spawned a little bit of waste from that. So, not too much here. Out of the water. In the water. Oh, dude. In the water does not look safe at all. I kind of want to tame that one wyvern while it's right there. I mean, all I need is regular crystal, right? To feed it. But if he goes flying around the map, we can't really catch up to him. Have to get some stuff made up, some narcotics and whatnot for maybe do a pterodon soon. I don't know. I need to take a look and see what the new taming stuff is because it's supposed to be all different, right? Dude, there's a ton of those dudes here. Is that a normal one or an alpha? It's another alpha. Please don't tear up my house, man. I just got it built. Dude, the colors look so nice on him, too. So those are regulars. And that's regular. Do we have any berries? We do. Should probably make a campfire here soon, too. Start cooking up some of the meat that we have before it spoils. Oh, I mean, we need to spoil some. We need to make a ramp to get in there, too. All right, so. It's you right there. Let's get that co cooking up. We'll put these in here. And let's make... Actually, can't fire first. Nice. So that's all going. Kind of need to wait for the metal. How much metal did we need for the smithy? So that one's 25. Oh, we're going to have to get some more. I think we got enough for 40 something, right? Or for. Yeah, we're going to need a little bit more. All right, let's go back over there. It's not that far away. It's just right up. I think over this hill. Try to get it before it hits nighttime. I think those should kind of glow at night, I think. Is that a heat wave coming on? I know they have heat waves sometimes on here. Good thing is, these are rare flowers, I think, right? Nope, fiber. Oh, I thought that was rare flowers. Hmm. Interesting. Did we destroy that one metal node that was up here? Might have, huh? Have to find some river rock or something. I don't know if there's any down by the water. Sorry, we'll go this way and check. See what's over here anyways. So there's those new things that killed us. High level too, that one is. Dude, there's no river rocks, man. Might have to just start beating some regular rocks. We don't get very much metal out of them. But, I mean, is what it is. 
Yeah, nothing over here either. Ah, oh, man. I think these all just have salt in them. For the most part. I mean, there's some metal too, but they're not like regular river rocks. Or do they have metal in them? Might just be all salt, flint, and stone. Yep, let's drop that. Oh, I eat the stem berries. They all got salt in them? I don't remember them ever having salt before. Of course, I never really stayed over on this side of the beach. I was always over by the ember biome and then by the floating isles, which is kind of a little ways from here. Not too far. There's a regular rock there. Oh, thank goodness. Nope. Salt as well. Dude, that sucks, man. Might have to... Might have to go for a trip. Change islands. I think we might just make a canoe. That way we can get around a little bit easier. Thatch fiber. Oh, we need hide for that? Interesting. It's alright. It's all easy stuff to come by. Oh, wait. There's metal there. Well, I tell you what. I hate using a stone pick on this stuff, man. It's like such a waste, you know? You lose so much of it. Might as well grab this one while we're here. Head back, throw it into the forge, and that should be plenty to make up the smithies and get some metal tools going at least. We'll probably still make up that canoe though, just to get around. Because apparently that's the safest way to travel. I think nothing messes with that in the water. Cool. I have no idea what side we were on. I think it was over here. There's supposed to be griffins on this map too with the, the, the mod pack. I mean, I know those are the normal ones usually, but there's supposed to be some of those new ones and different color patterns on them. It's kind of a main thing I'm interested in. A little ways off from getting those things tamed though. Oh, dude. Need to get a net launcher at least. We tamed one on the Viking map that we're playing on. Use a net launcher and then built the house around it. It kind of seemed better than trying to trap it normally. Fairly cheap for all the stuff too. Ah, there we go. We're over this way, I remember. That crystal. Leveler U. 45. Low level, but we just need to get some wings here before too long. And I don't think we're going to do any of the obelisk boss fights on this map. So there's an addition that we can put on with the Primal Fear to have roaming bosses. I didn't install it yet, but I figure we will. And that way we can just do boss fights out in the open. I don't want to focus too much on boss fights. I mean, it's kind of all we usually do in Ark. Mainly want to work on taming and stuff with all the new stuff, new creatures and whatnot. New taming mechanics. And then we, if we add in that roaming bosses, I mean, that'll be plenty there then, right? Not exactly sure how I feel about <laughs> bosses roaming around in the world, but I don't know. Kind of depends on how the mechanics work with them. All right, let's get this metal in the forge.
Good bit of food at least. Throw those over there so I don't eat them. Alright, so. Where are we at? Still missing metal. So we need crystal, one more metal ingot, and some wood. Let's grab the crystal. It's a waste on these things, too. Beating them with a stone pick. Dude, boy, I tell you what. <laughs> you start seeing shadows, man. What's up, buddy? You getting hungry? You want some? You want some crystal? We are getting nothing but stone from these. Oh, dude! I think we need 15 total. We've got one. We got five. <laughs> At all those rocks, we got five. You can't hit all of them either. It's kind of weird. Might have to go back up top there and grab some from that other one. I don't know if we're too far to... Yep, too far to pull stuff to repair. Ah, oh, man. I don't know. Maybe we should build the regular smithy first. I think we should because we don't need crystal for that one. Then we can build a metal pick and get stuff a little bit easier. All right, so there's our regular one. What are we missing for a pick? Oh, nice, we got everything. What about this one? We got everything. Nice. So, let's empty our inventory. We'll head out, grab the other ones. Should be a lot easier since we have the metal tools now, you know. Lasts a little bit longer, too. Not sure we couldn't hit that one. Or that one. Ah, oh, man, there we go. <laughs> I got so much more crystal with the metal pick, you know. So that'll be enough to make our other smithy, unless I use too much of our metal making the tools. So we need some more metal ingot and 45 wood. How are we doing on metal in here? It's still going. Cool. So let's leave this here. Should make a preserving bin before too long, too. Head over here, grab some wood, grab a little bit more metal from that node that was over there. I think there was one more left, right? Kind of over there where that wyvern's at. A little chillamite. Is that the same one? I think it is. Yep, level 90. Poor dude got stuck in a tree. Good time to be taming him, though. Then he doesn't fly around whenever... After you feed him. Maybe we should do that. We'll see how much crystal we can get from up here. I know they get a very low percent for each one that you feed them. Unless it's a primal crystal. Is that metal? 
That's part of the big crystal. I was going to say, I thought it was over further. Let's see if little buddy's still stuck in the tree over here. If so, we'll try to tame him. Nah, he got out. Oh, man, that sucks. That would have been a very, very easy team. Have to see if the net launcher works on those. Net one, and then just build up some pillars and stuff around it if it does. I know you can do a Quetzal. I just don't know if it'll work with the uh, Wyverns. Might be too big. Do we mine that other node? I thought there was one more over here. I guess not, huh? Dude, what's that sound? What is that? Can't look at a spyglass for nothing. A bunny rabbit. Interesting. Just saying, not sure if you're deadly, man. What's the health on those things? Holy crap. Eh, nothing special. Okay, that's a lot of pelt. Holy crap, that's a lot of pelt. We good? Yeah, seagulls. Dude, that thing was so loud. I thought it was a like a big dino coming for us. Ah, uh, yeah, no more metal. So we're done with metal over here. We'll definitely have to go exploring later for some. Let's get the rest of the wood we needed for building. It's actually some metal right here. Are you regular? You're a very big dodo. Toxic dodo. I only got four arrows. I am not going to mess with you. You leave me alone, I'll leave you alone. You could almost ride that one. He was so big, man. Holy crap. At least he didn't come running at us. Yet. Let's drop a little bit of the stone. Or, yeah, we'll drop some of the stone. It's easy to come by. I want to keep the fur in case we need it for something. Just because we got it so easy. If we get that canoe made, we can use that as a respawn point as well. Plus, it holds our food a little bit longer till we get a preserving bin and all that stuff sorted out. Thought the blunt bunny was explosive with the red dot. I know, I saw that red dot and I was just, I was kind of worried. <laughs> so I was saying, I'm surprised there was no uh, surprise mechanic to it, you know? Must have just been his tail, though. But yep, yep, I was worried too. Get some stamina back. We're almost back at base. So I don't know if the new creatures have specific taming for different ones. Like you have to use different methods. It's all stuff we'll have to figure out. Because you have the toxic and then the fabled. So it's like, can you use regular stuff to tame both? That's what I want to tame is one of those for base defense. Holy crap, dude. The thing is huge. All right, let's make our other smithy. I guess I'll just put it right here next to this one. Yep, so it's only specific for the mod. Holy crap, that is a lot of stuff, man. What are you? Rocket launcher. Okay, 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 okay. Waterproof. So you can use that underwater. Interesting. Forge, okay. Powered by gas. Yep, yep, yep. Hotter and faster than normal one. Okay. Okay. 
summon in a, bo a carnal boss. Okay, so we don't need to put that boss pack. We can actually summon in some bosses. Let's see. Let's let's do this. Eighteen times more powerful than a trank dart. Interesting. There's a primal fabricated rifle. Okay. Armor and hide piercing trank arrows. Tip with nar uh, potent narcotic. Okay. Primal metal arrows. Man, there is a lot of stuff. So that's stuff for use with a long neck. So that's a poison one. That's for apex tranquilizing. Okay. Okay, never mind. Full of... Okay, so we have to use these specifically for the kind that we're doing. So alpha, apex, poison, toxic. Okay, so where's the long neck? Yeah, new map, noob. It's, um, Crystal Isles, but we're doing it with the Primal Fear mob. Uh, mod. Not mob. Mod. So you just use a regular long neck? There's no more benches in here to make. These are all just... Saddles, armor, kibble. There's a shotgun. Interesting. So are those used for the regular one? Cannot be used with attachment. Okay. Oh, used in a long neck. I thought it was used in a specific long neck. So we need a dark casing and then primal stimulant. Okay. Health potions. So you can actually shoot your team and heal them. That is weird. Interesting, but weird. So there's a casing that we need. Fairly cheap, simple ammo, and just metal. Okay, okay, okay. And then the saddles. So that's for a fabled one. Alpha. Oh, man, that's the, uh, the flying ferrets there. And then the kibble. So it looks like we got to kill all of the special stuff. To make all the new, new kinds of kibble and whatnot. That's a boss. Hmm. That is a lot of stuff to deal with. Holy crap. So that'll heal your creatures. Oh, nice. So we don't have to worry about force feeding them food and everything. Primitive stew. Increases your health and puts you to sleep. So that's like regular narcotic. Just potent. Nine times more potent. Okay. Reduces food 50 times faster. Oh, dude, that'll help out with uh, taming for sure. So that's just stimulant and then flowers, mushrooms, berries, and seeds. Okay, 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 okay. I like it. I like it. So there's a lot of stuff, man. Holy crap. Cure is a terminal biovirus. What? There's viruses in here? Nobody said anything about that. So that's one that's 18 times. So we can probably use those narcotics instead of making up so many stem buckets to take with us. Or not stem buckets, but narcotic buckets to take when we go taming. So what do we do for like a normal pterodon? Is there like normal uh, arrows? Just like more potent? These all seem to be metal. And stuff that we don't have. So let's see, we're going to have to make the casings. And then where's one for regular use? So that's a potent one. That's a stimulant dart. That's a, Okay, so we need the light blue one, just a regular potent one. And then the potent narcotics. So that's made with seeds. Interesting. So narcotic and then some narco seeds and tinto seeds. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Well... Let's start off with some of the basics. <laughs> let's do... Let's get some more arrows made. Actually, we only need about 50 of these. We'll get us a pterodon. Oh, 
yeah, we'll get us a pterodon, be able to explore around a little bit, and then we need to figure out what we're going to do for our pack mule. I don't know if there's different kinds of parasaurs. That'd be good to start off with. That way we can run around, get more resources, and then the main thing we're going to be needing is metal for smelting. And then we'll go from there. Gonna need a mortar and pestle. Just missing stone. And we need to spoil some meat. I need to go out and kill some stuff to spoil meat. See, well, let's put that out for right now. Let's put you into there. Let's get rid of you. We'll just set this. We'll set it right here. It's a little crowd in here, I know. We'll get it all sorted out before too long. Alright, so we got enough arrows. Let's repair our bow. And where's our narco berries at? Start making some of that up. Mainly need to get some meat to spoil. We'll grab some berries along the way. Are you a normal trike? It is. That other one has me kind of worried, man. I think the best bet's gonna be probably going back over there. Let's make let's make that canoe, man. It's gonna be a lot easier getting around on that canoe. I mean, we've got everything for it, so. And then we'll head across. There's a parasaur over there. And then we'll keep an eye out over there for some metal and stuff. And get a lot of this meat spoiled out so we can get some more narcotics. Do a little bit of taming. It's a lot faster than running around. Unless we're landlocked over here. Yeah, we can get around. Nice. Oh, that's some of the dodos. Is that the exploding ones? Dude, I'm all paranoid when I see a dodo now. That's an alpha dodo. What? Aggressive? Probably. It's got alpha in the name. I wonder what the health is like on them, though. Guess we'll go find out. We'll shoot him with a couple arrows. Hopefully not die. I don't know if we can bola him either. Since it's an alpha one. I don't know, man. You can almost ride that thing. It's so big. Oh, dude. He, oh, he's aggressive. Oh, you can bola him. Interesting. Ah, not so big and bad with that bola, are you? I wonder what their health is like, though. Fairly, fairly high health. Oh, dude, everybody would have messed us up, too. Oh, wait, so we got special hide. Interesting. Have to keep it for later? I don't know if we can use that for regular building? You can't. So that is specific to probably some of the new blueprints that were in that one smithy. Did we get any meat? We did. Let's go ahead and take out this other one, too. Easy way to get meat, and then it'll kind of start stacking us up on that special hide. Mm-hmm. Do we need to tame that Crystal Wyvern? I'm just saying. He's, like, flying around. We'd lose probably a lot of taming effectiveness because we wouldn't feed him right away. But as much as he's over there, that would be like a huge game changer this early on. I 
It's a 135. Oh, Alpha Blood. That was in one of the Royce's pieces as well. Oh, it has a spoil timer on it. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, dude, that's an Alpha Pego. What did you steal? Oh, thief. That is terrifying. Dude, look at him run, man. Holy crap, he's a runner. That dude is sprinting like crazy. Oh, dude, I wonder if there's... Don't tell me there's going to be Alpha Micro Raptors or Perlovia. Oh, dude, I tell you what. We're not going in the cold biome. <laughs> not going there. Y'all normal? You are. Thank goodness. A lot easier to kill. All right, let's separate all this. Make sure it spoils. So we got 39. All right, that should be enough to make up narcotics for a pterodon. Let's see if we can find one around here. Just to scout it out real quick. As we make our way back, I know there was a couple down over here. That's a 25. Way too low. I mean, we're starving. And all this meat on you, man. Turn over this way, and then we'll head back over and make up our narcotics and stuff. We're probably going to need some berries anyways, so we'll grab some of those along the way. I'd like to find at least a level 50 or so on the pterodon. Just, just something for some wings, you know? Get around a little bit easier. And we'll have to figure out what biome we want to actually build in. I was thinking over by the floating isles. I mean, it's not exactly safe over there. I mean, it's not really safe anywhere, I guess, right? With this mod pack on. level are you 55 all right so we can come back over here to this island as soon as we get those darts made up start probably tr taking that one out we got uh we got two bowlers left so that should work throw our canoe out head back across the water you like a little jet ski man Ah, uh, you know what? We're going to need a bunch of chitin to be able to make our saddle. So there's that little trilomite we saw. I think there's like two of them over here. We'll kill them. Should get a good little bit of chitin and then some other stuff we need too. I keep forgetting those things require chitin. The saddles, you know. How much do we actually need? Oh, there's different versions of those, too. Interesting. Normal one is 75. Oh, that's where the alpha hide comes in at. For the alpha... Oh, there's fable hide, too. Holy crap, dude. We're going to need so much stuff for storage. All right, leave you in there. Leave all of you in there. eat that. I wanted to spoil. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Alright, so. Narcotics. Enough to craft one. What are we missing? Oh. There we go. So that's only going to give us 20. I mean, that was a low-level pterodon, so that should be just enough. Well, that is crafting. Let's try to find us... 
trilomites. Are the dolphins normal at least? Thank goodness. Can't mess with the dolphins, you know. See, that'll definitely be the easiest. I don't know where their scorpion's at. And I don't want to try to smack around the trikes. It's because we need a whole bunch of arrows. Should probably get a crossbow for the trilomites if they're going to be in the water. I thought there were some on the shore over here, though. Maybe not. Might have gone back in the water. I know one of these little islands has the uh, has scorpions on it. We could go over there to the desert biome. It's not too far. It's a little bit of a canoe ride, but I mean, kind of need the chitin anyways, right? Let's do that. So we need to go that direction. Might take a few minutes, but that's the easiest way to get the chitin, I think, right now, is from the scorpions. Unless we figure out on the way which, uh, which island has them. What was that? You're tearing up my canoe, man. Just built it. Kind of expensive. Kind of give us a chance to see what's around anyways, right? Some big bubbles down there. I remember there being bubbles before. Must be new. There's oil down here, though. What else we got down here? Nothing. Not much of anything. Hmm. Weird. We need to go around this island here to get around. So hopefully none of the new alpha creatures will mess with the canoe either. Because we will be very far from base if something happens. Some pterodons over there too. It's a 130. Okay. So there's actually two high level ones. When we come back, well, get in the boat, man. Whenever we come back with the uh, stuff for the saddle. What is that? Is that like a golem? Captain Black Boulder. <laughs> I have no idea what that even is. It looks like one of the rock elementals. Interesting. Slightly terrifying at the same time. That's right over where we were going to tame that pterodon at. It's another crystal wyvern, too. So we got to watch out and make sure we don't tag one of the alpha pterodons. Just because we don't have the stuff we need to knock it out and tame it. I think they require the special kibble, or maybe the kibble is just additional. I don't know. Well, that might be a long swim to get over to the desert biome. There's Gigas over there, too. we got to watch out for those. And then the Ravagers. I'd really like to get a Ravager teamed while we're on this map. Dude, those Dodos are so big, man. I'm telling you, they should have a saddle for it. Be able to ride them.
Oh, did he? He did one on Crystal Isles. I'll have to take a look at it. Definitely like to see what else other people are doing. I was trying to do the first video or two without looking at anybody, just so, because it's all new. Kind of wanted to figure some of it out, but dude, there is a lot more to this mod pack than I thought there was. Definitely going to have to look it up because, oh man, is there so much stuff. Especially with all the different creature parts. Like with the alpha ones and then the different kinds of creatures. So I know that there's some that are... I think there's supposed to be like a progression list for you to go through or something like that. I'll definitely have to look it up before the next video. I think we'll jump out here and cut across the land, get there a little bit faster. Yeah, we're not far. Just right there on that tip of that one should have some scorpions there. As long as we don't die in the process. <laughs> it's always it's always a possibility. I totally forgot about the sparkles at night around here. I always like that about the center map. How it's got all those green sparkles at night, like little fireflies. But I think what I'm going to do after this video is up the dino count a little bit on the map because everything seems really super spread out. Oh, there we go, right down here. That's a straight shot through the water. If we're going to stay over here on the beach side, though, we should definitely move once we get kind of established a little bit better and kind of come closer to here where we're more than just, you know, one biome around. There's multiples because the ember one's right over there as well. That's got a long spoil time on it, at least on the alpha blood without being a refrigerator. All right, so the main thing we got to worry about over here is the snakes and then those other wyverns. This is where it kind of starts to get to where those aggressive wyverns are. We're freezing. What do you mean we're freezing, man? We're in a desert, dude. That's another alpha one. <laughs> Eyes glowing and everything. Tell you what, man. A pack of those things are terrifying. Be good little guard dogs at base if they're tameable. Gonna break out of that bowl here in a second. Oh, dude, I thought he was coming for us. At least they run when they're almost dead, you know? Instead of coming at you. I mean, where's all the scorpions at? We're in the desert. 
Shouldn't be any dodos all over here. Dehydrated, yep. We're right by the water, man. We'll grab some right here. What is that? That is weird. It's a big old pack of little bunnies. All spawned together. Ah, there you go, man. Quit hollering. A little bit of food. It's gonna get hot. Oh, man, it's coming up daytime. It's gonna get really hot over here. So. The desert is a desert. There's a trike. Is that a normal one? It is. I don't know, man. If we don't find any scorpions over here, we might just have to kill off a bunch of turtles and stuff. We have to make a bunch more arrows and get a crossbow. Because I'm not seeing anything out over here. I mean, other than the snake. Little dung beetles, that'll work. I think they give you chitin, right? Those things are tough, man. Yep, there we go. Cool. So one more, and that'll be enough. Of course, you would break right now. It's all right, man. Cool. So there's the stuff we need for that. A little bit of fiber and a little bit of high. We should have all that back at base. Oh, man. Start the long journey back. Oh, you know what? I did not mark our base on the map. Hmm. That's going to be interesting trying to find that again. I think we're around 8520, I think is where it was. Get rid of some of these berries out of our inventory. Oh, yeah, let's uh, split all that. And that'll spoil real quick. That'll be more narcotics for us for whenever we get back over here. Ah, there's daytime. Nice, man. It's going to be nice whenever we get some... Get some wings and be able to fly around a little bit easier. So I think what we'll do after that is... So get the Pterodon. That'll give me a chance to be able to get resources a little bit quicker. And then figure out about either an Argentavis or a Parasaur. So we can start getting stuff a little bit faster than that. And build a... Find a place for an actual base. And kind of set up our main camp. And we can start taming. Start getting all this uh, like new stuff together. I think a lot of it has to do with berries and whatnot. Different narcotics and stuff like that for the different kinds of teams. Bunch more of those brachiosauruses. I have to look up too to see what those are about. It'd be awesome to be able to tame them. 
Kind of like the big brother of the Bronto, you know? At least we don't have to worry about the artifact runs either. Since we're not doing the regular boss fights, we'll do just like the, the ones for the the mod itself. So that'll save having to do all those runs again because, man, there's a ton of them on this map. Is that a normal must chop? That thing looks huge. An elder one. Interesting. That's another variant that we haven't seen yet. So Elder, Alpha, Apex, and Toxic are the ones that we've seen in Fabled. We'll just cut across right here. Hopefully that Dillo will leave us alone. How far are we from our potential where our base was? I think it goes up around that kind of islands in front of us, I think. We'll have to look when we get up closer to it. Some more of those bubbles that we saw. Yep, yep, yep. I think it's just right up around this way. We'll go this way instead. Just cut across the land. Dude, I don't want the rocks, man. All that time I was searching for rocks whenever we first started, and now they're all over the place. Well, I tell you what. <laughs> I just want to get in the boat. Or pick the boat up. Oh, dude, I'll tell you what. One of the seagulls. Really should have looked at the map before we left to see where base was. Hey, how's it going, Dust? Just trying to get some stuff together to get a Pterodon saddle. We're playing with the new Primal Fear mod. Or not the new one, but a new map with Primal Fear on it. And it's, uh, it's definitely interesting. There's a lot of new stuff on it with the way the creatures are. Had to go all the way over to the desert to find some chitin for our saddle. So we got everything we need to make the saddle back at base now. We just need to grab one and then bola it and get it tamed up. Yeah, okay. That's where base is, right over by that one. Nice, okay, cool. Is that another leads or is that the same one? Yep, I see you guys. I am not stopping. Oh, they're not coming for us. It's fine with me. Fine with me. I think that's where base is, right? Oh, man. I don't know. <laughs> Mistakes have been made. I thought it was right there by that rock. Or by that uh, crystal. Hey, Lucas. How's it going, man? We are currently trying to find our base. I took a long run over to the desert area to grab some chitin for a pterodon saddle. And totally forgot to look to see where our base was before we left. How's everything going with you today? Oh, dude. Yep. Yep, yep. 
yep, yep, yep. Do not kill me. Tell you what we're gonna do. Let's pick this up. Quickly run to the other side, get away from him. Is this the one where our base is? That might be the one where our base is. New series? Yeah. We kind of have Valgaro still. I kind of left it though. We did a vote a couple days back about trying out the new, or trying out a Primal Fear mod. And doing a different map. I tried doing a procedural generated map, but man, everything was really, really jacked up. And yep, there's our base. Everything was really messed up with it. I don't know, the creatures were spawning in so many, and yeah, so I decided just to do it on Crystal Isles. Mods, yeah, we started modded series now. We are done with Vanilla Ark. Another one of the rabbits. So loud, man. Are you coming for me? Man, I'll tell you what. There's a bunch of them over here. And now the Trilomites come out of the water. Oh, I'll tell you what. Now that I don't need the chitin. So we're only running with a couple mods on here. We got the Primal Fear. We've got Auto Ingrams. So it just kind of unlocks all the Ingrams for me without me having to do it. And then it's got... The one for the soul balls, kind of like the cryopods. That's kind of it. I got the death one where you can grab your your loot easier whenever you die, but I don't really, I don't, haven't used it yet much. Or at all, really. Alright, so there's that. How many? We got 20. Let's make all those. We'll grab stuff to... We're gonna need some more wood. Repair our... Bow. And then we'll head out and try to grab a Pterodon. There were some back on that island. I think one was a level 100 and 130. We got one bola left. Man, I wish we had some more. Let's grab a little bit more narcotics. Just so we have a couple extra arrows. Seems how somebody has bad aim and always misses. Just saying. That's the way it goes. What mods? It's just the Primal Fear. Auto Ingrams. I think it's called Dino Storage. Is the one with the soul balls. And then I have that the one, the gravestone one for your death. I just haven't really messed with it yet. I'm trying not to use that one because the whole kind of part of arc is if you die, you know, you got to run back and get your stuff, man. So I don't know. That That's the only four that we have right now. I was looking at the different spyglass ones, but I don't know. They're, uh... Some of them are a little bit too much, you know? Alright, well those last ten are making up. Let's get us a saddle. Oh, we need hide. Dude, I thought we had enough hide! We really don't have enough hide? That's 76. Let's kill some of those rabbits that were out here. I think there was a Parasaur that was over there, too. We'll bola him, kill him off. Grab his hide, and then that should be enough to make up the saddle, or part of the saddle. It's always such a chore when you're starting off, you know? What's up, buddy? Hopefully get almost 100 out of this one. Nice. Okay, cool. Halfway there. So we need, what, two, two something? 230. We've got 170.
These things are so loud, man. They're kind of cool, though. Wonder what their purpose is. The amount of arrows they take. Oh my gosh, they got more health than a regular dodo. So there's enough for that. I need to get, kill one more of them just so I can make up some bolas. There was two of them over here when we were coming back to base. I hear you. We'll run them back that way. You gonna really go in the water? That little dude can swim, man. I'm not chasing him through the water. <laughs> it ain't gonna happen. Let's get that made first. Oh, we can make some bolas. We're fine. We got two of them. That'll be plenty. Yeah, the bunnies, man. They're so loud, little dudes. Ah, oh, we're crafting. We can't keep up with him. He's going in the water, too. Nice. Alright, let's go empty our inventory and head out and grab us our pterodon. Gotta grab some berries as well. I think we got some purple ones over here. Stronger than a raptor, I know, right? Dude, some of the dodos in here are stronger than a raptor. With this uh with the primal fear. Yeah, we got killed like two minutes into the video because of a uh, one that explodes. All right, you hold on to all of that. We got some purple berries. That'll be enough for right now. We'll take some of the red. Oh well, we'll get some more. We'll keep some stuff to repair the bow, just in case. Always need it. I think we're good. Repair you. I think the other ten of those. All right. Head over here and grab one of these two pterodons that we saw. Or was it over there? Or was it over here? We'll go over here. Whatever we find, we find. Low level is fine. Just need it for scouting around. Preferably one that won't kill us. I know there is the other versions of those. But I can't wait to start getting some of those other darts and stuff made. I think that's one of the level 100 ones we saw. Fifty-five. I mean, it'll work. Get him to come down. It'll be real easy to tame, at least. Not that many arrows, not that many berries. Let him fly around for a minute. Let's see where that other ones were. While we're waiting for him to land. Oh, it was over here, wasn't it? With that weird rock elemental. Yep, yep. Right there. That's one of them. Dude, we are always starving. Hopefully that rock elemental thing doesn't come for us. That thing.
Looks like that one raptor, or raptor, one pterodon landed over here. Try to get a bowl on him real quick. 130, nice. Couple arrows, hopefully we can get him knocked out. Don't fly away. Nice, nice. All right, we good? Big boy over there's got me worried, man. Them arrows back. Things are expensive. Oh, he eats meat. What am I doing? I always do that with pterodons. For some reason, I think that they eat berries. Building a cafe in the game? That'd be kind of cool, man. It's always nice to build different things, you know? We don't have anything over here to kill easily for meat. Ah, dude. That should be enough, though, to get him tamed. I always think pterodons eat berries for some reason. Alright, let's see if we can find anything over here with some raw meat. Tame up a little bit faster. We can't really kill anything that has prime meat right now. Nothing, boy, I tell you what. No little bunnies hopping around? There's a dodo up here. Oh, dude, there's one of the... Let's put our regular arrows in here. I see it coming. It's one of those toxic ones, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, zombie dodo. What? See, that's another variant that we haven't seen yet. Watch it be all spoiled meat. No, nope, regular meat. Okay. Spoiled meat would have been fine. Being a zombie and all, you know. Oh, where's our pterodon at? Got some raw meat for you, buddy. 8% on those. I mean, it's cooked, though. Try to find him a little bit more. Get that other dodo that was up here. So there's toxic and toxic zombie. That just, I mean, that just sounds terrifying. We're out of bolas, though. So if something comes for us, it comes for us. Or yet, I hear you. There you are. Now we could probably just go ahead and set our our boat out over here too. So if we die, you know, you kind of respawn right here, since it is used as a respawn point. There we go. Nice and safe. Safe-ish. You're never safe. All right, where'd little dude go to? He's right there. Well, that'll be our first tame. And that'll allow us to get around a bit easier. And like I said, start scouting for a place to put our permanent base. We're probably going to need to use some narcotics on him soon. So he's got all normal stats. I think the other ones have different stats, right? The different variants. It's a 150. I'm glad I did not mess up and punch you, dude. Holy crap. Don't run him over, man. He's sleeping. A year ago, there was someone on YouTube, a BB Rex, asked him to give him a fruit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, mine do that. Whenever we were getting ready for the boss fight. My Rex were wanting berries. It's like, oh, dude, that is not something a Rex should be asking for. Oh, yep. Mm-hmm. You all right? Ah, dude, I tell you what. I got to not run towards stuff now. Seems how they're not normal creatures. I think we got plenty of meat, though. We should be fine. <laughs> hmm. 
No, the toxic one. Oh, dude! Oh, we are in a very bad situation. Do not mess up my pterodon, please. Kill me, just don't kill him. Oh, he is fast. Oh, man, is he fast. That is, yeah, yep, mm-hmm. Did you get your, your second wind? <gasps> what is that he threw out? Are those parrots? Oh, my gosh. We just got one-shotted. So that's a thing. I need to get back over there to our death marker because that's our... We got our, um... Our saddles in there. And he's like, he's gonna guard it now, isn't he? This is a very horrible place to try to tame something. He came at us from nowhere, too. He was like way over here. I mean, he has a, that's a big boy. No kidding. Dude, get in the boat. Quit with the rocks, man. You gotta, we gotta work on this, okay? I really need my bag. I need him to, I need to kite him off somewhere. I do not want him killing our pterodon. It's taken the past hour just to get stuff for that saddle because we had to go so far. I wonder if I can run up, grab it, get in the boat, and then get away. I mean, not with those birds that he sent out after us. I think they were like parents, wasn't it? That is really close to him. I just want my bag, man. You can have your island. I just want the bird and my bag. Oh, dude, we were so close. <laughs> I got scared. Oh, he's coming. I heard that tree. Quit with the rocks, man. Oh, shake and bake. Yep, yep. Oh, we're dead again. Oh, we're dead. Dude. That thing is no joke, man. Our canoe's still there. So your bag can actually land in the canoe. That's something I didn't know. Only thing that sucks is... Oh, there it is. There's our other bag. I was going to say, I don't know where our other bag is exactly. I need to get back over to our bird, man. I need to put some narcotics into him. Make sure he's not going to wake up. We'll deal with getting our bag in a minute. Stay over there, dude. Yeah, it's one of the... The bosses that are around that kind of roam. How you doing, buddy? Not that good, huh? Where's your berries? Did I not put them in there? I thought I put them berries in there. So yeah, there's some roaming bosses with that mod. And I'm guessing that's one of them. Cool looking, though. Looks pretty cool. Alright, let's feed him a couple berries. I guess I could turn this on. I keep forgetting about that thing. And he should have enough meat, right? Yeah, he's good on meat. Alright. Operation Get Our Stuff Part 3. I think what I might do... Get his attention and drag him to that side of the island. I think that's going to be the best bet. Drag him over there. All right, let's get our stamina. Actually, let's just grab our bag, man. What are you doing? I'm trying to get his attention for it. Just grab your bag and get out of here. There we go. Shake and bake, man. <laughs> that dude is no joke. I wonder what it's going to take to kill him. What level is he? 
He's only at level 25. All right, buddy, I need you to tame up in like fairly fast, if you can, please. Throw these berries into there for safekeeping. What else is around here? I should not actually go searching, but kind of want to see what other things are around. So yeah, it looks like whenever he gets aggro, he had two attacks. He had the birds and then the ground pound, like a normal, normal rock elemental. Let's go to this side of the island. He's gonna be a few minutes still, man. I don't know of anything small that we can get prime meat from that will speed that up. I mean, he should be fairly safe-ish. The boss didn't kind of go for him. He came right for us, you know? Oh, you know what? I should have put the saddle into him. That way, if we die and can't get back to it, it's not that big of a deal. Wait, what is that? Is that a death marker? What is that from? Is that our first death marker that we had? I don't know. Oh, that's whenever that first dodo blew us up. Okay, so we, we spawned not too far from where we were. Are you normal? You are. It's level 100. You're not aggressive, are you? No? Okay. Cool. Oh, there's our... <laughs> there's our body. It's standing up. Yep, 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 yep. That is definitely us. Take your resources. Take your berries. Wait, where's our clothes at? Did I not get our... Are we wearing... Or wearing them? Drop all this stuff. Cool. We'll go feed that to uh, our pterodon. <laughs> That's kind of wrong, man. I'm just saying. So out of this whole place, that was the one and only exploding dodo that I've seen. And that got us like two minutes into the video. Well, little buddy, 75%, so what? Maybe one more bite, and he should be good? Let's kill this dude, get some hide. We're gonna be needing some back at base. Sorry, buddy, you weren't gonna make it very long anyway. There's a lot of bad stuff around here. Oh, that's a 145. I thought it said a 55. Is that an Orvoraptor? Sounded like it. All right, buddy. I need to take one more bite. We need to get off this island. I mean, we're not going very far, just right over there, but we need to get off of this one in particular. Oh, I'll tell you what, 91%. So maybe one more bite. <laughs> That's close. Caught some friends at your house, all of them play Ark. Oh, nice, nice. Surprising how many people actually play Ark. Get rid of the seagull while we're waiting. Shouldn't be but another two or three minutes to so take one more bite and we'll be good.
Isn't it your birthday today, Lucas? I'll tell you what, I cannot hit anything. All right, we just need to stop. It's it's getting beyond embarrassing now. Yep, yep, gonna leave that alone. He's fine. He's fine. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy birthday. I thought you said it was. See, I got rooms around far, man. He's already gone again. He started off way out over that way. Oh, there he is. I don't want to get aggro from him. This dude's almost done, man. I don't want to mess it up. 98% effectiveness, so that's not too bad. He should be all right. Get some good levels out of him. Put most stuff into, I'm guessing, speed and stamina so we don't have to land. Seems like everything's so aggressive. Nice. There we go. Oh, dude. Let's put this on you. Let's get out of here. We'll check out your stats in a minute. I want to pick up our canoe. Put it back over near base. In case we die again. Let's turn this off. Wait, buddy, buddy, buddy. I need you to stay right there. Like, don't move. It'll be fine. It'll be all right. Ah, oh, nice. Well, we got our first team, and it's a flyer. Check out some stats real quick. So it's a male. Teamed out to be level 193. 1300 on the health. Stamina is 412. Weight is 201. Damage is 379 and 135 movement speed. Let's put that into stamina. Probably the first couple will go into stamina just to keep him from having to land too much. What is that? Is that a tech parasaur? That's a primal one. 135. Is that... Is that aggressive? We good? No, we are not good. Uh oh, dude. Holy crap, man. Oh, dude. We're going to lose our pterodon. Buddy, I, ca I can't... If we lose him now... Oh, dude. We got 17 seconds of that bleed effect. Now we can out heal him. Holy crap, man. All right, well, so that's a thing. Primal ones are not safe either. Dude, that's a high level though, 135. Wonder if we can tame that normally. I don't think so, right? I think we got to do use that special stuff. I'll tell you what, let's, let's leave the pterodon over at base. Where is base? Did I pass base? Dude, why am I getting so lost on this map? Yeah, base should be over here. Right? Yeah, over there. I kind of want to leave our stuff and see if we can't trank him. Oh, dude, it's another pego. I right, mean, you need to calm down over there. Alpha pegos, man. That, that should not be a thing ever. How can you hit me this high up? What'd you steal, you thief? Huh? Something heavy, huh? Yep, yep, yep. I tell you what, I need to land and get some stamina. So I need to just stop attacking stuff since we can't, uh, can't kill stuff as easy, right? But you, I'll make an exception for you. 
That dude does 104 per hit. Oh my gosh, he is so fast, dude! That dude runs like nobody's business. I'm gonna kill you, man. It's I'm on a mission now. He's almost dead, too. Should be good levels for our Pterodon, I'm hoping. Oh, man. Dude, that guy was no joke, dude. We get all of our stuff back that he was. Oh man, it's another dodo. This map's gonna give me a heart attack. So we got nine levels. A little bit into health. <laughs> a little bit into stamina. Oh, dude. This is not safe at all. I, I, I see you down there, buddy. I see you, man. I wanna know what's in this bag that he stole from me. All my stuff. Well, I tell you what, I didn't realize he took my bow as well. Let's right, kill off this last dodo just to get a couple more points for our pterodon. Our little battle bird, man. So, what is that? So you get toxic blood and alpha. Dude, there is so much we're gonna need for storage. All right, let's get back to base before we end up losing somebody. Uh, you know what I need to make real quick before we go? I need to make the cryopod gun. Oh, we need polymer. Oh, we can't make that. We need paste and polymer. Hey, how's it going, Logan? We are in a very, very bad place. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Dude, it is not safe. Well, we got some little shacks set up. We got us a pterodon. We need to figure out what we can do to get a parasaur. I like the one that was over there, the primal one. I'll have to see what we need to tame that. And... Try to get that for a pack mule so we can try to find a place to start setting up base. We definitely need to get a place where we can build and only have one or two sides that stuff can come for us at. You can make a toxic arrow. Oh, yeah, yeah. So they're all down in um in the smithy here. You're so sad. Why are you sad? Yeah, so we can make all that stuff here. I got that set up. And I just need to see what we need to make the primal... Was it called Primal? Yeah, Primal stuff we gotta make for taming that, that one, I think. That's Primal Stimulant. We'll have to see, though. Only watch your stream after you're done or, or when it's weekend. That's all good, man. That, that's why I've, I put the videos to where they can be seen afterwards. So that everybody can watch them whenever they have time. You know, I don't expect everybody to make the live stream, but that's why I always put them up and have uh, YouTube record them and put them on there when they're done. So it's all good, man. But, like I was saying, we got all the stuff we got for the Pterodon, and we need to find us a pack mule, find a place to build a base. However, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. It's definitely an interesting mod, and I'm kind of glad we did it on Crystal Isles, man. There's It's a huge map and so much here for us to do. But we're going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope everybody enjoyed the video, and I appreciate everybody showing up to the live stream. We'll try to get another one probably on Wednesday. I'm looking at doing Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, or Monday, Wednesday, and Saturdays for live streams. It's not set in stone yet, but that's kind of where I'm, I'm looking at doing on them for right now.
Kicker skin so orange. I think it's just the lighting. He is a little bit orange. Just a little bit. It's uh, it's from being out in the sun, man. It's uh, <laughs> that's the way it goes sometimes. Have a good night. Yeah, I appreciate it. But we're going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching. And we'll see you in the next one.